welcome back to another video. I have an original idea for you guys today. Well, all my ideas are original, but I like the more intricate ones that I come up with that aren't really based off a specific theme. So the polishes I'm using are this really beautiful baby blue you see right here called beach blue and then this other color is like a lighter blue like a sky blue I don't know why I didn't make this the base but it's called bazinga and later on you're gonna see why I was kind of frustrated because well oh my god it got covered up and you couldn't even see the well I was trying to make it kind of like an ombre for the sky but it ended up not even ombre got it covered up by the clouds that I'm drawing right here and so it really didn't matter but it's still cute though right you guys the end result was really cute so I'm just gonna finish drawing up these clouds here I'm just gonna draw some clouds and I'm using a polish so it was kind of hard I couldn't find my white acrylic paint so I'm just going to draw the clouds with the brush and kind of dab in with the polish brush anywhere that needs a little more op opacity. So that's what I'm doing here. It's been really hot over here recently. I mean, uh, when I paint my nails now, it, I'm always like not drenched, but like suffering, you guys, because it's so hot outside. So I'm so happy fall is coming soon. And now what I'm doing is I'm drawing some little diamonds that I'm making for like twinkly little magical specks. And I love this brush that I'm using, you guys. It's a cheap one, but it's my favorite nail art brush that I got from a cheap set off Amazon. So I'm drawing another little twinkly I'm going to draw not many of them because I don't want it to really be too much of it I just want it to be kind of simple and then I'm going to make it more intricate looking with a glitter later on so yeah just drawing on the little twinklies twinkle twinkle little star how i wonder what you are <laughs> you guys don't want to hear me sing or chant twinkle twinkle little star do we i don't know and just going to perfect it a little bit because my manny needs to look perfect. As I said before, I don't have to be perfect. You don't have to be perfect. My manny, though, gotta be perfect. So I'm just gonna finish that up. And I, I was really, like, happy with how this part came out. I really took my time. It came out perfect. And then I'm using this gold glitter called Gold Shimmer. It's by Clean Color. And the base is really, you know, thick. So it was a little hard to work with. But uh, if you use like a sponge or like a cotton swab, as I like to do sometimes, it comes out really well, really opaque so and really shiny. So I'm just going to use the brush that came with the bottle. And then I'm going to use a cotton swab and blend that in so just gonna do that do it on all my nails the reason why i didn't do this first is because i didn't want it to overpower the blue base i kind of wanted to just put it in certain areas after i was done painting most of everything so yeah doing on my last nail driving is going really well by the way you guys my Right turns are a little bit better than my left turns because I'm right-handed, I guess. But it's all coming out really, really well right now. So I'm really happy to drive on the main road soon. And I'll tell you guys more about that. The more I progress, the more stuff I have to tell. I'll tell you guys everything. So now I'm using this other glitter. It's called, it's, ooh, this is beautiful, it's so beautiful. It's got like chunky white hexes and gold glitters in it. 
and it's called oh my god i didn't even show what it's called <laughs> oh my god I'm trying to see if i can see it in there anyways i'll have it in the description but yeah um i'm just gonna put some of that on my mat and i'm just going to fish for some of the glitters the gold glitters not the white ones the gold ones and I'm gonna put them in random areas again I don't want this to be too much I just want it to be in certain little areas since we already got that gold glitter coming on going on right now and it's not really um, too much it's not really too much of a gold shimmer going on on camera right now but you can really see it in person or in certain lighting so I don't know why it's not showing up on camera right now um, I did put a lot of gold shimmer on but I guess it's just the camera it's okay you guys I think the swatch photo is a little better so anyways yeah just gonna fish out for some of those gold glitters and put them in wherever I feel makes it look the most pretty goes put another one right there and then put another one down here on my pointer finger another one on the side and I'm just using big glitters and small glitters depending on what kind of looks best on placement for me. It really doesn't matter, but I kind of just wanted to try and make everywhere look as neat as possible, which is something I do with all my manicures, obviously. <laughs> I think we all try to make our manicures look the best, and so... I wear my manicures not very long the most I'll wear is one week sometimes I change my polish every couple of days but since I never know how long it's gonna last and how long or when I'm gonna get a new idea in mind I always try to make it come out as good as possible because these are my hands you guys and I want something really pretty to look at when I get bored and look at my hands so yeah <laughs> But yeah, anyways, you guys, that's it. Sorry about the background noise. You never know sometimes. You never know. Here's my swatch photo. I hope you enjoyed. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys.